We've been following traffic situations across the area all night from Route 8 in Montgomery County to Interstate 81 and dozens of roads in between. Thousands of people have been stuck in traffic, some for hours. And as the temperatures continue to drop, the added blowing snow is making roads dangerous. This is a live look at mile marker 128 on Interstate 81. As you can see, traffic is at a standstill, slowly moving there. According to a VDOT spokesperson, crews arrived on scene to begin assessing the situation at around 830 tonight in Montgomery County. Because the ground was so warm, VDOT says they did not treat the roads last week. There have been multiple accidents across the area due to the snow tonight, but those cold temperatures mean the roads will likely stay frozen. 10 News reporter Arisha Jones is braving the cold in the New River Valley tonight, where we're seeing the worst of the weather and the traffic. So Arisha, it's been very touch and go all evening into the night. That's right, Lindsay, and it is cold out here, and that's exactly what's causing all the problems tonight. I'm off Interstate 81 at mile marker 128, where we've seen some standstill tra traffic, and it's actually uh, kind of moving slowly at the moment, but the Virginia Department of Transportation told me about an hour ago the interstate has been treated for ice and is back open. Cars and trucks are now moving as heavy congestion may take a bit to clear out, but again, all lanes are open. Montgomery County Dispatch says their phone lines were busy with calls this afternoon with people calling in about accidents on several roads, such as the one we saw tonight on Route 11 around 830. Virginia State Police were also out helping to work some of these calls, and they say no one was hurt. We did see some snow on the roads, which is less than an inch where we are right now in Toronto. Now, it is still important to be careful if you're going to be out on the roads driving. VDOT says they're reporting some icy patterns patches on some of the primary rows in the county. Live in Montgomery County, Arisha Jones, 10 News, working for you.